Hello everyone. Thank you for tuning into my channel. Today I'm coming to you with my top 10 natural hair products. All right, so I have been asked this question so many times. What are my top favorite natural hair products? And I think some of the inspiration behind this question comes from the fact that I try out so many products for review. I wanna share with you my favorites out of everything. So I'll start with cleansers, washing products, and then I'll go into the stylers and hair care products. So my top number one product, starting with shampoo, is the Shea Moisture Yucca and Baobab Thickening Shampoo. If you are someone who's been following me for a long time, you know that I have an affinity for Shea Moisture products. I love them. Um, the fact that they are all natural, they do not have offending ingredients like parabens, sulfates, glycols, any um, synthetic preservatives or any of those other things like mineral oil, none of that. It has none of that. And so for that reason, I've always admired their products. So for shampoos, I chose this one because it has a great smell. It is extremely moisturizing. I find that when I use it, my hair feels really soft afterwards and I don't necessarily feel like it's stripped or anything like that, even though it's a shampoo. So my number two product um, for cleansing would be the As I Am Coconut Co-Wash. And this is something that I've been using recently because as many of you know, co-wash products are new on the market, really. And for someone who is not into shampooing or you don't shampoo often, and you just want something to cleanse your hair, but that's more um, aggressive than a conditioner, you just want something to get you clean, the Coconut Co-wash is definitely a good investment. It leaves your hair feeling really soft, really moisturized, and you know that it's cleansing because there is a surfactant in there. However, it is not one of the offending ingredients like a salt and it doesn't leave you really stripped. It is also mild enough that you can use it every day, unlike a shampoo where you need time for your hair to recuperate. You can feel confident in co-washing with this every single day and getting your hair clean if needed. And if you choose to use it as on a weekly basis, it will do the job just as well. Um, just be careful if you decide to use a co-washing product like this and you do use products with ingredients like silicones or mineral oil, petroleum, because the detergents in this are not strong enough to get those out of your hair. So you may wanna invest in a shampoo maybe once a month at least just to make sure you get all the product buildup and residue off of your hair. My number three product for washing is the Shea Moisture Raw Shea Butter Restorative Conditioner. And I love this product so much. I have actually been using this product since the very beginning of my journey. I use it as a conditioner and I also use it as a leave-in. Um, and the reason why I love this conditioner so much is because it is totally made for someone who needs moisture. I have 4B Afro textured hair that's on the kinky coily side and my hair dries out really very really quickly. So using a conditioner that has a shea butter base helps to keep the moisture in my hair. It's also infused with lots of oils. When you put it on, your hair immediately feels soft and really feels moisturized. But however, this product doesn't have that much slip. So you would wanna make sure you either detangle before so you can use something else, maybe a cheapy conditioner, or detangle with this and a little bit of water and oil like in a detangling cocktail um, or something like that. But it also doubles as a leave-in, so if you wanted to just use your conditioner and not have to invest in another product, this would totally be great because it's a two-in-one and you definitely get your money's worth because this product goes a very long way and it's really affordable. So my number four top favorite product would be the Shea Moisture Deep treatment mask and this is a deep conditioner and the reason why I love this product so much is like the other Shea Moisture products they're all natural and this deep conditioner really keeps your hair moisturized it also doesn't have a lot of slip like the like the restorative conditioner so you don't want to detangle with this but you do want to use this you know every week if, or every other week depending on your hair care regimen 
as your deep conditioner. You can leave this on your hair and put a cap on. You can feel confident in just putting a towel on and, and knowing that it's gonna deep condition your hair. Don't necessarily need to go under the dryer, but if you have one, you can do that as well. Um, or you can use this under the steamer or do it as an overnight treatment. However you decide, this stuff will leave your hair really soft and moisturized and give you the deep conditioning that you're looking for. Um, this product is also not very expensive and it comes in a very large jar that takes you a little while to get through if you're not heavy handed of course. So my number five product would be the Shea Moisture Yucca and Baobab Thickening Moisture Mist. And if you are someone who's been around for a while on my channel, then you know I often refer to this as the Biotin Mist because it is infused with Biotin as well as Yucca. And for those of you who are not familiar with Biotin, Biotin is a natural vitamin mineral that can be found in many foods, so you don't necessarily have to use this product to get Biotin. However, because it is infused with Biotin, when you use this on your wet hair, you are infusing Biotin into your hair. The Yucca in this product also helps to thicken the hair strand, not permanently, it's more temporary where you put it on your hair and if your hair is very fine, you may get that look of thickening, however it's not going to make your hair go from the Crip Keeper to this. <laughs> but it will give you the appearance of thicker looking hair. It's now, one of those hair refreshers, replenishers that when you spray, they actually feel like they're doing something really good. It doesn't just feel like you're putting water on your hair. I like to use this on freshly washed hair. I spray it onto my hair and then I will continue on with my moisturizing. You can also use it as a replenisher to wake up your hair in the evening if you wanted to re-twist your hair at night or if you have um, looser texture hair and you like to spray your hair to wake up your curl pattern this is definitely good for that and my number six product is the Shea Moisture Yucca and Aloe Thickening Growth Milk so I've already explained that I have an affinity for Shea Moisture so it's no surprise that this product is also by Shea Moisture. I use this as a leave-in and it can also be used as a styler. But I love this as a leave-in because it's not as thick and creamy as the stylers that I prefer to use, but it has enough weight on it that as a leave-in it works really good under other products. It leaves my hair really soft like the Biotin Mist. It's infused with Biotin and it's infused with ba Baobab oil and Yucca. Um, really good smell, very light. I actually use this on my son's hair from time to time because he has a nice curl pattern that wakes up very easily and he doesn't need heavy products so using this on his hair really wakes it up which lets me know that if you have a looser texture like 3C, 3B, maybe even a 4A, this could be great for wash and goes, would leave your hair really moisturized, soft, give you a good shine without the heavy weight of something like a creamy butter. My number, my number seven product would be oil. This is coconut Jamaican black castor oil and I don't have the original jar that this comes in but this, but this particular brand that I'm using is by Tropic Isle. Tropic Isle can be found online, Amazon. If you live in New York, you can find this at many beauty supply stores. It's not something that's difficult to come around but I prefer coconut Jamaican black castor oil specifically because I love the benefits of coconut oil. Um, penetrates into the hair strand, great amount of protein for your hair, gives you so much added shine. And I also love the benefits of castor oil. It's very thick, very thick. And the minerals and nutrients in castor oil are so good for your hair, not to mention that castor oil helps in stimulating hair growth. So coconut castor oil is the best of both worlds. The two oils are together in one and you get all of the benefits. My number eight product would be the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie. This is my absolute favorite moisturizer. If you have thick curly hair, you need moisture. Moisture, moisture, moisture. And Shea Moisture has the most amazing moisturizer. This moisturizer will leave your hair feeling really soft and moisturized. The shine is amazing and the suppleness of your hair is like none other. When I use this product for twist out or braid out, my hair is so full and thick and luscious. It's absolutely amazing. It does not dry out by the end of the day. And 
and I'm not worried about how my hair will feel at the end of the day because it's going to feel so soft and luscious. I do want to point out that when I use the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie and it, the day just happens to be a humid day like in the spring or definitely in the summer, my twist outs just do not last as long because the product does not have a lot of holding power. It's a very soft hold product and the glycerin just re responds to that humidity like crazy and I will end up with a poofy full of hair at the end of the day. So I prefer to use this product in the winter and in the fall when the temperatures are cooler to avoid frizzing out. My number nine favorite product is the Miss Jessie's Curly Meringue. Now, I don't really talk a lot about this product. It's kind of like a secret weapon um, and I don't talk about it a lot because I don't use it all the time, but I use it enough that this container is almost done. And my favorite way to use the Curly Meringue by Miss Jessie's is as a styling product for finishing my hair when I know that the weather is going to be humid or when I'm concerned about my hair maintaining its curl pattern throughout the entire day. So if I have to go to an event that I may be hosting or attending and I know that I want my hair to look exactly as it did when I took my twist down or I took my braids down, I will make sure to put the curly meringue on my hair while I'm styling. And I'll put this on in the same way that you would use any other butter, just to make sure that this is the last thing that touches my hair before I twist or I braid. And when I do use this product, it gives me the most amazing hold, almost to the point of being crunchy, but not too crunchy. Um, just enough that my hair still feels soft, good shine, and I know that my twist out will last, and it does. My braid outs and twist outs last when I use this product. And my number 10 favorite product is the As I Am Double Butter Cream. This is a new product to my collection and if I had made this video a week ago, this product wouldn't have even existed to me and it would not have been in this video. But this product is absolutely amazing. I have this product in my hair right now and this is a day five twist out. I've been using the product at night to retwist my hair just to ensure that I have the same level of curl definition in the morning and when I tell you that this product gives me the most amazing curl definition with the softest holds and super shine. I don't even have to tell you. You can just see it. It is absolutely amazing and you don't need to use anything under it and it will not dry you out. I strictly use this product with some coconut Jamaican black castor oil and my twist outs look stunning. It lasts so long, I mean I'm not even frizzed out and I've been having my hair for five days now just retwisting at night to ensure that I have a nice curl. However, I've used many other products and over a week's period, my curls will not look like this, ever. I've never seen my hair look like this after five days on a twist out. So this is my number 10 favorite product um, uh, for natural hair. So that's my top 10 products for natural hair. I really do hope that this was helpful. So let me know if any of my top 10 favorites are your top 10 favorites. I would love to know. And if you have different top 10 favorites, share them below. Maybe somebody else will find them and want to try them. If you have any questions, please leave them below. And as always, I love you for watching. Bye.